What do you get if you blend 40 years of innovation into what's ultimately the first namesake in hot hatches? The answer is this, Volkswagen Golf GTI Club Sport. The Golf GTI Club Sport is one incredibly, incredibly special vehicle because basically it's taken all the hard work of Volkswagen clever engineers to put together something here which is what the GTI ultimately always should have been. It's loads and loads of power all driven through an incredibly nimble and agile body and all pushed through the front wheels and it makes for the absolute ride of your life. Now when you take the Golf GTI Club Sport it's got a 2 litre turbo engine Basically, you think of it as a Golf R engine, which is effectively what it is, in a slightly different state of tune. But perhaps where it's most impressive, more than absolutely anything, is the fact that the GTI Club Sport has now got 195 kilowatts of power. That up quite a lot from the just below 170 odd kilowatts of power in a regular GTI, or the 206 kilowatts in the Golf R but remember however with the GTI Club Sport the minute you hit the stage 2 and you've got your foot planted flat you get 213 kilowatts of power 213 kilowatts through the front wheels and something of this size the result is this Yeah, those little dumps as you change gear it is electric this car not only can you feel exactly where this car is at all times it's communicative it's planted it the drive of it is a something unbelievable i mean you first see you're holding this steering wheel which is dressed in suede already there's the sense of occasion as you jump inside you've got these sporty supportive bucket seats now these are an additional option it's 18,000 rand for these but in my opinion well worth it they look fantastic and they hug you extremely tight something you certainly want in the club sport apart from that there's a couple of other options on here which I would also spec on the club sport okay it's got the navigation system that's about 20,000 rand not something you terribly uh, not something terribly important in a performance car like this you've got dynamic operated audio system but what is important is you've got this dynamic body control selector now that makes it feel tighter more planted firmer on the road and it just makes the drive even more electric oh it is so good to drive this car to take it around windy roads like this it is unbelievable the GTI always was a special car but in this club sport edition it is something else it really is hats off to the guys at VW who created this and unfortunately they've got a bit of a worry on their hands because it's going to be very hard to top this one it is special now Volkswagen have announced that they're bringing a Club Sport S here soon it'll be limited to a handful of units I mean I've driven the Golf GTI, I've driven the GTR, the Performance Pack, I've driven the Scirocco R and I've driven the Golf R and while all of them are jolly lovely vehicles this GTI Club Sport to me is the ultimate, it is exceptional it's poised, it's delicate on the road, it's light, the steering is fantastic and the way it, the noise it produces and the way it kicks you back into these bucket seats is something else you just egged on all the time to drop another gear, push it that bit harder, and as you change, you get that burst from the exhaust. Wow, I love this thing. Now, of course, the Club Sport, as with any Golf GTI, is not just about pure raw racing aggression. A Golf has got to be a lot more than that. Remember, the Golf has got to be a practical family car, a comfortable long-distance cruiser. It's got to have good boot space, got to have decent space in the back for a passenger and it's got to all be coupled in ultimately what's rolled into the ultimate fun package and of course the club sport delivers on all those fronts from me jason of technobock this really has been an absolute treat until next time i'll see you guys soon cheers for now technobock